Hey everybody, welcome back. Jordan here from Beyond Brixie, and this is a, another day vlog. It's actually the previous day. It's 2.03 a.m. Just finished scheduling my live stream here for the blacksmith. I'll be picking up the blacksmith, well, technically today when I wake up, uh, because it's uh, issued at the LEGO store February uh, 1st, 2021, and it's a LEGO idea set. It looks pretty killer. Just finished making my thumbnail and uploading that. Plan on building it today at 4 o'clock. The LEGO store opens at 11, so hopefully I can cruise on over there in the morning and grab one when I wake up and just sort of go from there. Also, we got a lot of other stuff planned for tomorrow as well. As we know, I just finished parting out the entire Coliseum, so we're gonna build the Boom Castle as well. Not gonna do that tomorrow. Gonna focus on the blacksmith. That's more important than the Boom Castle at this time. Not to say that I'm hyped, not hyped about that, but this is a new issue and I gotta focus on that. So I'm gonna head off to bed here once my video actually finishes uploading and then, uh, get ready for a big day tomorrow so I'll probably touch base before I go to sleep actually because I don't even know how long, much longer I'll be up because I gotta upload this video and it should be doing it right now and it's not not a good use of time so that's scheduled for tomorrow on Brixie's YouTube channel and I just started uploading this vlog here on Beyond Brixie 22 minutes left it is 2 10 a.m. I can't actually finish uploading this video until those 22 minutes are over because there's some things that you got to do at the very end but I'm going to do those in the morning. I'm exhausted and we got to get up early to get the blacksmith. Woohoo! All right, it's the morning of blacksmith launch now. Just got to go launch the Brixie video. No, Beyond Brixie video and then we're off to the Lego store. Got my camera charging for the Lego store video that we're going to make today. The Beyond Brixie video is launched and now we're going to go walk my dogs, freshen up, eat some breakfast, rolling out to the Lego store. So lately I've actually been getting to the Lego store, you know, like an hour or even two hours or sometimes even three hours early for these release dates. Uh, the Lego store now opens in 50 minutes and I haven't even left my house yet. And the reason why is because I went there to get the, the police station early and I also went there to get Ninjago City Gardens early. And when I arrived, there was not a huge lineup. And then when I went there the following days, they had those two items in stock. So there's no need for me to get there early. Let's hope me getting there like half an hour early or 20 minutes early just bite me in the butt. So everyone, we've arrived here at the Lego store in West Summit Mall, and we can see that the medieval blacksmith is actually on display just right back there. 20 minutes before it opens up, and there's a Starbucks right here, and I got the mobile app, so I decided, let's get a coffee. I'm not sure how I feel about this because it's not Tim Hortons. <laughs> I'm just kidding. This is a uh, pistachio latte. I don't know how I feel about that. It's looking pretty good though, isn't it? Wow, look at that. It's got some like sugar on the top, whatever the heck that is. So everyone, I just finished up at the Lego store here in West Summit Mall and we did pretty good. Uh, I'm finished with that camera now as I'm done my vlog. I should probably turn that off. Picked up a couple different sets there. Uh, the Medieval Blacksmith, of course. Also the Lego Ideas Dinosaur Fossil Set and one pick a brick cup. And we've got a few other things that we got to do in the mall today in particular. We gotta go uh, to my P.O. box and see if there's any fan mail. And then we've gotta do uh, some other stuff as well. So let's get on that and then we can get on home and start building this medieval blacksmith set. First things first, I need some shipping boxes for Lego. Conveniently, the cardboard room here in West Summit Mall has Lego shipping boxes in it. I'm literally just gonna take all of these because that's gonna make my life easy when it comes to shipping Brickling quarters. So I'm pretty sure there's a uh, parcel here at my P.O. box from a familiar face. Ratsky, buddy. Pretty sure it's there, we'll find out. That's a big one, Bretsky. Can't wait to open it up during a live stream on the Brixie YouTube channel. Just processing my video now for buying the Medieval Blacksmith. It was so funny, while I was there, I uh, messaged Kevin, my buddy, the brick building biker, 
uh, who's just a local Edmontonian as well, and, and obviously a big Lego fan. He was like, no way, I'm not getting the medieval black blacksmith. It's not my style. I don't want it. Blah, 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 blah. It's not good. I sent him a picture of it, and I was like, dude, you got to go get that. <clears throat> he just sends me a picture of a selfie of him in his car. He's just got a big Lego ba uh, bag in the background. And he's like, well... <laughs> oh man too funny too funny it was hilarious it's it's good times we're gonna be building that in uh just over three hours the video's got 21 minutes to process here i better make a fancy schmancy thumbnail for it am i taking the time to cut myself out yes yes i am i will show you the before and after sorry about my old crappy monitor don't ask me why i use my old crappy monitor and not my good one so this is the original photo, and this is what I turned it into. I think that's pretty cool. You got some minifigures, you got a word there. Also, look at the difference in the Lego sign. See that? Yeah. Photoshop, thank you. So my video is uploading, it's about two minutes away. And I figured I'll do some shipping. Hey, a couple more neat and tidy shipments done by Brixie. I'm going to store the rest away in my little storeroom here. Also now, hey, the lights are done. This is actually perfect. We're going to make a little video here on the graveyard mock. So I guess it's a, what, four videos today for Brixie? We have the Lego store uh, shopping. We have this one here, the graveyard. And we're also going to be doing a time lapse on the medieval blacksmith as we build that one there. So I just got this new phone here and it seems like the camera, although very smooth, is jittery. It almost like the gimbal pauses and then, and then moves. So actually there's a there's an update right now on the phone and it says improved camera quality. So I'm hoping that takes care of it. Part of the reason why I got this phone is because of the camera. I love it, but if it's gonna be jittery, that's not good for me. The phone's updated and actually the camera is working even better now. It said camera upgrade and it's working even better. <laughs> That's awesome. So it seems like they fixed the glitch. It's cool they can fix the glitch um, like remotely like that. Pretty cool. Seems to be working good now. It's like sometimes this, I think the stabilizer before was working too hard. And for that reason, it would actually sort of jitter around. It would stop and then jump. But now it seems to be gliding smoothly. Maybe a little bit better than it was. Beauty. Just finished my review on the graveyard and now I'm going to place it in the city. Now that I've got that video done, we're going to start building this in about an hour or so. The blacksmith. Thing looks beauty. I've got to set up my camera for uh, a time lapse and all that jazz. So we're going to do that. She's a beauty though. It's huge. When I looked at it in the Lego store, I was like, holy cow. I think it's big and it comes with some awesome minifigs as well. So I'm pretty pumped to start building that. Just going to cook what I cook best. A bagel and eggs. Bam, 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 I love e eggs. And coffee in a Mickey mug. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Coffee in a Mickey mug is the way to go. I forgot to spray the pan. <laughs> no! Just taught myself a trick though, if you spray the spatula and you spray around the eggs, you just glide right underneath it. Doesn't matter if you forgot to spray it. <laughs> Too cool. Dad's gotta go to work. Not really work, but he's gotta go build the Lego set. I like this setup. I got YouTube here, my audio library that plays during the live stream on the other side. You can see we have 111 viewers waiting. We got the Streamlab software. I've got a full screen right here with chat that's blowing up a little bit. That way when I'm reading chat right here, I'm looking into the mic. And then I've got the Medieval Blacksmith right here and our time-lapse camera going right here, capturing everything here on my desk. I think I dig it. Also, this mic can be like up here, right above the camera. So it captures everything and you can't see it in the screen. I think it's the ideal streaming setup here for Brixie. The set had 14 bags and we've built bags one through five. Really good looking set. We got the apple tree there. It's got the target on the side. Lots of great interior detail. Uh, light brick on the side here. Press this in, it'll light up. It is looking great. Now I've decided that we're gonna switch gears here. Shift gears, I guess. 
and we're gonna unbox this. This is the box that we picked up earlier today, and we're gonna be doing it live. Oh, I'm super excited to see what's in this parcel here. I sort of already know what's in there, but I don't know. Maybe it, there's an unexpected surprise in there. Some sort of gag or funny thing, I don't know. I guess we'll find out right away here. Three minutes, live. <laughs> oh my gosh, Bretzky got me so good. First off, it came wrapped in like pink wrapping paper. It came with this other Star Wars wrapping paper. It had a pink bow on it, and it was in a garbage bag. And it was one giant puzzle. He had it all mixed up. <laughs> but look how good it looks. He also inscribed Bretzky versus Brixie 2020 on it. And it was one big mixed up puzzle. And of course, I built the frame and everything on it. But what a blast that was. <laughs> Unboxing it. It took about an hour to reassemble. Oh, it looks so good though. And I'm definitely not going to change the wording on it. That will be hung here in the Lego room on the art wall in the very near future, probably tomorrow as I time-lapse the whole thing and also filmed an intro, gonna film an outro and hang it and make a video out of unboxing the Iron Man art customized by Bretzky. Just uploading my graveyard video now, transferring my huge file for this thing here. Gonna go eat and watch WandaVision and then I'm gonna come down here and start editing and uploading and finishing all this stuff off for the night. And we're sitting at about, uh, Eight o'clock exactly. This thing looks awesome though. Looks like we're eating some pork, potatoes, and broccoli. I'm gonna eat this pie too, but first I'm gonna crack a beer, watch the first episode of WandaVision, then I'm gonna eat that pie. We just finished watching WandaVision, so now we've watched episodes one through four. Wow, crazy man. That's nuts. I don't want to say any spoilers for those of you who haven't seen it, but... That was good. I liked it. It's got a good storyline. It's just cooking and it's going to become a pretty awesome show. Uh, so it's now 11 o'clock. I'm going to finish this vlog, but I've decided that, you know what? I'm going to make a short for this uh, YouTube channel for Beyond Brixie right now as well. I don't, I don't care. I'm, I'm excited. I want to, I want to do a short. I didn't do it earlier today because we've been swamped all day. As you guys know, so I'm going to go downstairs. I'm going to figure that out right now. Actually, I just think I just thought of it. So uh, I'm going to go take care of that. Just uploading the late night short onto Beyond Bricksy right now. I decided to take a look at all of my Brickheads. And I think these shorts are going to be really fun, you know. If we want to take a look at all the art really quickly in a two minute video. Or if we want to take a quick look at uh, maybe a set that I don't feel like spending a lot of time reviewing. But we want to have a quick look at it. We could do a short video. And I think I'm going to start pumping out a lot of those. Not pumping them out, but... Um, I think I'm going to upload our regular vlogs at like 8 in the morning, but then I'm going to do uh, the shorts at like night. So at like 10, 11, or 12 at night. And there'll just be like a little extra video that if you guys want to watch, you can feel free to do so. And it'll be collection overviews and stuff like that. Wow, did we ever have a very busy uh, day today? Uh, stayed up late last night. We got all those parts and pieces sorted for the Boone Castle, and we're going to be building that uh, real soon here. That's going to be awesome. Woke up bright and early, and then we went to the Lego store. And we picked up the um, the blacksmith, and we made a video on that, of course. And then we came home, we uploaded that video, we started building that. And before we started doing that, we uh, reviewed the graveyard and worked on placing the graveyard here in the Lego room. In the Lego city, I should say. Uh, then we unboxed Bretzky's art. That was pretty cool. <laughs> that was that was crazy. I didn't expect that. That was sort of like a, oh, wow moment, you know? And we got that all unboxed there, and it's looking good, and I can't wait to hang that uh, here in the Lego room. That really did take me by surprise. If you're watching this, Bretzky, thank you so much for the, uh, the Iron Man art and the nice surprise of me having to uh, solve the puzzle <laughs> during a live stream. It's pretty funny, actually. Uh, yeah, and then we watched WandaVision, blown away by that. That was crazy. And then we made a short video. Where does time go, hey? It's nuts. Got lots of stuff going on here in the Lego room, and we're going to continue progressing and making daily vlogs. I hope you guys like these daily vlogs. 
if I could do more, I would do more. I just can't leave my house and it turns out that, uh, well, I can't leave my house. I can go to the Lego store and stuff like that, but I can't go to movies and I can't leave the country and I can't travel on flights and I can't do normally, like do that stuff normally. I would be going like to BC or I would be going to, I don't know, like a vacation once a year or twice a year even. And I'd have some interesting things that we could make videos on and make daily vlogs on. And eventually we'll get past that. I'm not saying that Lego is not interesting. I'm having a blast doing it. But I uh, like making videos for both channels daily. And I like live streaming daily. So right now it's a day, like it takes a lot of effort to make daily videos. And the only time that I take time off in my own working life, because this is working, but luckily for me, it's my passion. I love to do it, is when I go on holidays. So if I can't leave the country or can't leave the province or I can't go to BC and visit my brother or can't do anything like that, then I'm not going to do anything but make videos and play with Lego and build a Lego room, period. That's all I'm going to do all day, every day, because this is my hobby turned into my job and I have no other hobbies at this point. So that's, it's sad. It's not sad. It's awesome. <laughs> that's it. I'll leave you with that. Everybody remember to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for some more great stuff. Bye.